this whole entire video. It's just gonna be one big mood. You're gonna see me go, this is a bad day, this is a great day, this is a bad day, this is a great day. Are you getting whiplash yet? Cause I am. Wow, I love my characters. I would die for them. Let's torture them. <laughs> I love how I just finished editing um, my NaNoWriMo, but it's March video, and I dress up for it, and then it's back to the grunge. Hello, and welcome to the channel. I'm your host, Anthony Sark. Y'all can just call me Anthony. <laughs> I have taken my vitamins. I have had some jerky. Jerky is love. Jerky is life. <laughs> And now, we are going to write. The goal for the writing vlog today is to, <laughs> you know, I don't know, get some writing done? You can just tell this is just me procrastinating. We are already procrastinating and we haven't even opened up the laptop. Great. Great. I really just want to read. I will be honest with you. There is a webcomic I am reading and that's all I want to do right now. It calls me. And so, you know, I'm gonna have to resist the call. Oh, it pains my soul. <laughs> I'm gonna continue on the project that I've been working on. I don't really know where I'm gonna start. I don't, I don't even know. All I know is we've gotta get some words in and we gotta get some words in now. Because it's March 1st in the goal for Anthe's NaNoWriMo, but it's March. I kind of need the words in, now that I've put pressure on myself. It's just this much more difficult. Let's go, let's do this, let's write. Stop procrastinating, Anthe. Anthe, get your crap together and stop procrastinating. That's the same goes for y'all out there. Anything you're procrastinating, you know, here's 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 two words for you. It's, 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 it's mind boggling. Let me, let me tell you, my mind is blown when I, when I heard it. Stop it. Wow! <laughs> I know, blood, uh, brilliant. Total, I know, brilliant, brilliant. Anthe, you have an amazing grasp of the obvious. Okay, enough procrastinating. I'm gonna write. And you're gonna watch me. <laughs> So I've gotten 350 words done. That's not enough. That's not enough. We need way more. We need way more people. Except I'm tired and I just want a nap. It's my mid-afternoon slump. <laughs> oh. Okay, I'm gonna write a little bit more. I usually get my second wind 
like after 10 p.m. and then I get more writing done but I just want to keep going like there's it is 4 47 right now okay I have five more hours you can you imagine how much writing I could get in five hours if I actually sat down and had the brain power and ability to write I don't even know so funny because I'm like struggling with this thing of I don't know what to write anymore I don't know what makes me happy because I'm like I'm trying to connect this and that does this make sense in the story who cares if it makes sense in the story <laughs> I'm at the point where I don't care if it makes sense just it doesn't make you happy are you smiling while you're writing it no then it's not jail nothing trash <laughs> but this this is the struggle that I'm going through my brain just doesn't connect the dots no more what do I like? I don't know. Quality is always bad when there's limited light. But you know what? My room is only lit with one lamp. <laughs> and you know, can't be bothered to go get up and turn on the lights. So this is what we're working with. It's late because I'm a night owl and I still have some words to write. So that's what I'm going to do. I really just want to keep reading. <laughs> really just want to keep reading. I don't... But I can do this. Now that I've set a deadline and a goal for myself, now I don't want to do it. <laughs> the key is I don't even know what scenes I want anymore. Or what scenes can I steal? <laughs> Scenes used to come to me and now they don't anymore. Concepts come to me, but not scenes. So, I don't know what I'm gonna do. We're gonna try, we're gonna keep trying. Let's just keep going. All right, 50,000 words worth of I don't know what I'm doing scenes. That'll work, that'll work. Everybody's fed. I've been fed. Dad has been fed. And puppies have been fed. Hi. Hi. Please don't pull down my shirt. <laughs> You're getting fresh there, aren't you? They're number one. <laughs> Life is always good with puppies. <laughs> I need a shower. But I can't shower unless I do my laundry, so... I'm so tired that I don't know if I'm... I need to write. <sighs> it's so funny because... Oh. It's my... It's my B12 pill, that's what she was smelling. <laughs> anyway, what was I saying? Yeah, my brain. Wow. Lots of brain fog today. You're probably gonna see me in this shirt for quite a lot this month, just saying, because this is literally my favorite shirt. I got 1,250 words done. Not really enough to do the 50,000 words in a month, but you know, we're gonna try. We're gonna try again. Life calls. All right, I'm gonna go do some life and then maybe we'll get some writing done. We shall see. Stay tuned. This is why you should groom before getting on the camera. But you know what? This is reality. <laughs> this is the reality of, of it. All right, you, you know, authenticity. Yeah. And the real authenticity is I actually have a hole in my pants, which you will not see, but there is a hole mm -hmm. in my upper backside, so. This is the reality. Authenticity and reality. That's what YouTube is for. This is why I'm not on Instagram. <laughs> Instagram is too pretty for me. <laughs> I think if anyone came in my room right now, they'd be going, what the frick, Anthe? It's freezing in here. Why is it freezing? 
And it's because the window is open. Anthony, it's winter. Why is the window open? Because. So yes, it's absolutely freezing in my room right now. Like my feet are cold and Luna is under the covers right now. And I put the heating blanket on and probably in about 30 minutes to an hour, I'll get hot. I just need the heating blanket and I'm good to go. We get fresh air, it's cold. I think better in cold air, so. I know, I love you too. Zelda is more like me. She's warm blooded. Hot blooded. Zelda, are you hot blooded? Yes, you are. You're a hot blooded puppy. I got some laundry in, so that's gonna wash. And then once that goes in the dryer, I can take a shower. <laughs> yeah, you can tell. I have let things go. I need to do the dishes too, but you know. Laundry. We're doing laundry and shower today. That's on the priority list, so. And then maybe I can get some writing done. I'm gonna try to get some writing done now. We'll see. My brain. Wow, it's midnight and I didn't even realize it. Oh my goodness. Hi, Zelda. She's looking up at the wall. She sees something on the wall. Do you see how intense she is right now? That's because there are things on my wall that the previous owners left that I haven't bothered to take. <laughs> but she's very intent on looking <laughs> looking at it. This is why I, this is this is this little girl is my bug catcher. Zelda thinks that that's bug. Zelda, it's not a bug. It's not a bug. Nuna is all comfy under the blankets. You should be too. Man, part of the day was bad. <laughs> it was so bad. I was struggling. I felt creatively dead. Everything was a struggle. I just looked at the page and go, what am I doing? Questioning my entire life. <laughs> Questioning everything. And so I finally was got the laundry in um, and in the dryer. And then I went into the shower because I was, I was like, okay, well, I'm not getting anything done. Maybe a shower would help me because sometimes when I've showered, I can get ideas in the shower. The only problem is when it come out, the ideas are gone. <laughs> they go away. And I sit down and go, what was I even thinking anymore? So thankfully the shower did kickstart my brain and I was able to sit down and write. So the number is 2,820. I want to get to 3,000 because that means I have officially kind of continue to me meet my mark. So I can get just a couple more in, a couple of paragraphs more. We're good for the evening. Evening. I say evening. It's midnight. It's midnight. It's time for bed. That is the update for today or this evening. 
but yeah day two and we are kind of hitting the mark I am gonna finish writing and then we will see what tomorrow brings <laughs> The dishes are running. It's a good, it's a good day so far. <laughs> oh, the little things matter. I'm gonna eat, relax, and I'll take my pills. I'll take my vitamins after this, and then get started on some writing. So that is the goal for today. That'll be the goal every day for the next next while. The only problem is I probably should push it for the first two weeks because I'm going to get a vaccination on March, what, 13th or 12th or something? I think it's March 12th. So, because it's not Friday the 13th. Um, so yeah, my whole, the rest of my month might be screwed up because, you know, sometimes get symptoms afterward. <sighs> we will see how that goes. If I can write 3,000 words a day, then that's kind of pushing it and reaching my goals, which is above and beyond the 50K in a month. So, and you know what? Hey, we'll do April too. <laughs> Let's do NaNoWriMo every month of, of the entire year, except I miss January and February. Whoops. No. <laughs> oh, that's my babies. My babies. I don't know why my skin is flaking, but oh, oh wow. Oh wow, look at this monkey. Oh wow, she is on the bat. Oh my goodness. Look at her, she got up on the ledge. Who are you, Zelda? Look at that. Hi, are you a monkey? What do you do? <laughs> Hi. Lena, that's as far as I can go. She's got her foot on my back. Gotta love the very first thing I do when I get out of the shower and get dressed is put on PJ like clothes. Because what's life without being in pajamas constantly? We're gonna try, we're gonna do the thing, we're gonna do the thing, we're gonna do the thing. And hopefully write 3K today, even though the goal is only 2K. It's 11 p.m., and I think I've gotten about 500 words done today. I have been struggling with scenes all day, all day, all day, Zelda. I have not been able, that is my struggle now. It, I used to be able to just come up with cute scenes. They, they would just come into my mind and they just, they just don't anymore. There's just nothing there. And it's like pulling teeth. And I, I just, I don't know how. Coming up with a plot or just a spark of an idea, that's that's not so hard. It's just creating life. <laughs> Those things that are most memorable to you in, in a book. I don't know what it is. I don't know where it went, 
but it's gone and I need to find it. Help me find it. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. So my day has been spent procrastinating <laughs> and looking up help videos on YouTube. And one of them was like, actually it was Emily Bourne's video and it was like two years old and she's like, I use this notebook to write down these bullet point ideas. I'm like, okay, I whip out a tiny notebook and I'm like trying and trying. And you know what? It's the notebook's fault. So I bought a new no notebook. <laughs> it's definitely the notebook's fault. So I bought a new one. Because you know, hey, why not? And you know, I bought two manga too. So because like, why not? Because I can. Because I can. The struggle is real. I'm going to keep writing well into the middle of the night because I have to. I got to cut my hair. At least the bangs, so they're not mm, so much in my face. 1225, which, you know, hey, it's decent. It's just not 2K, which is their needed amount to make it through the goals. It's 2 AM. Might have gotten distracted by Brandon Sanderson lectures on YouTube. You know, procrastination. Um. I have some thoughts. I will talk about them tomorrow. I actually have to dump all my videos onto my laptop because my phone is telling me I only have 23 minutes left of room to record, so I'll have to delete some stuff. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna go to sleep and maybe tomorrow will be better. Maybe. Here's to hoping. It's still a good day. It's just most of my day is trying to write where a very short amount of my day is actual writing. <laughs> We're trying. We're trying. Keyword trying. <laughs> Good night. I am literally pacing. Trying to get some kind of semblance of inf inspiration. I need to make a dedicated video on this because this has been my problem. And that is, I am standing here, pacing, trying to think up some ideas or just, just trying to figure out where to go next in my story. And there's nothing. It's not even like I get an idea, oh, no, that's not gonna work. Or, oh, yeah, no, it's not gonna work. There's nothing. There's flat line. It's zero. Nothing is going on in my brain. Literally, <laughs> just, just nothing, nothing whatsoever. And I'm standing here and this never was like this. It never was like this before. I don't know how to fix it. I'm like, how do you write scenes? How do you come up with scenes? And everybody's like, oh, well, let me just think about it. Whole entire video is just going to be one big mood. You're going to see me go. It's it's this is this is a bad day. This is a great day. This is a bad day. This is a great day. Are you getting whiplash yet? Because I am. <laughs> this was what it was like last month, but now there's a little bit more just pressure on myself to produce more, which is not a bad thing. It's not a bad thing. It's just a thing. I want more i want more i just uh, don't know how to produce more i don't know how to pull it from my brain we'll keep going we're gonna pace some more pace listen to music and pace what more could i do <laughs> besides scream but then the neighbors will think i'm having a problem <laughs> which i am i've written 87 words that's it. It's been a long day of nothing. It's been a long day of nothing. And it's mainly because there's just nothing up here. Nothing. The characters don't think, I'm not thinking, I'm not feeling them, nothing. And even if I went and like, oh, I'll just switch to another project. No, it's the same. It's the same for everything. This has been my struggle, so.
And now I'm documenting it. <laughs> Go me. Tomorrow's a new day. Tomorrow's a new day. There's a lot to talk about for today. I only got 87 words done. It was a bad day of me just sitting at the computer and trying and it wasn't working. This, this was not working. And so uh, my dad suggested setting an alarm and waking up to it. The problem with that is that I have had insomnia for a while and so my sleep cycle tends to be, I will fall asleep between 1 to 3 a.m. That's a.m., hon. <laughs> that's a.m., darlings. That's, that's a.m. <laughs> and um, so, yeah, I set an alarm for 8 a.m. today. And I woke up. I've been awake since 8 a.m. when I fell asleep after 3. So... The fact that I'm still alive is real, a real miracle here. We have to acknowledge that. But, um, it's a better day. Not the best day, but a better day. I've written, um, 1,261 words. Ha are we reaching the goal for the week? Mm, not quite. The goal is 2K every day. And I'm behind 5K. So... I want to take a break every week and not write on Sundays, but we will see what happens. <laughs> we will see what happens. I need to, I have written a total of 6,896 words for the week. 6,000, almost 6,900 words basically. So, I mean, not bad. It's not, it's not my old days where I was writing 35,000 words in a week. I've written 35,000 words in a week and published them. So that was a different person. That person existed. Where is she? Somebody find her. <laughs> I did get some ideas. So things kind of, I had some scenes go on in my head. So that was good. I was like, okay, great. And I bought a new notebook and I have filled four pages in it. So writing has happened in a different medium. Are we gonna get a bedtime treat? Do you want a bedtime treat? <laughs> Got him <them> trained. <laughs> they know what a bedtime treat is. I purposely stopped in the middle of a fun part of writing so that maybe, hopefully, Tomorrow, I'll start and go, this will be real fun. Let's go. Let's continue this. First meal of the day. Uh, that's a rice cracker with cream cheese and everything but the bagel seasoning. Strawberry scrapes and some jerky. I enjoyed it so much yesterday that I'm going for it today, except I was still kind of hungry at the end of it, so that's why I added grapes today. I have had a good morning. I have written 350 words in total, so I'm going to eat and continue. I have some brain today. Two days ago, we had no brain. Today I got some brain and I gotta use it while I got it. <laughs> I'm gonna eat. Hopefully I don't lose it after eating it. <laughs> Hopefully I don't lose it after eating.
It's been an amazing day. It's not like it was an amazing... It was an amazing day, period. But I only got like 1,700 words done. But it was the happiest I've ever been. Like I felt actual glee today. I have not ha felt actual glee writing in seven years. And I haven't really felt the light bulb on in four. So to have the light bulb turn on and have glee, wow, like I'm like, whoa. I don't know what to do with myself, whoa. <laughs> so yeah, it's been kind of like, wow. I am having a lot of fun here. <laughs> I mean, if you have been watching this entire vid video and you've gotten to this point, you know how bad it was two days ago. My brain is like, let's go low, let's go high. You woohoo. What the frick frick panty wick. <laughs> oh. Today, I wrote the emotional climax of my story. And when I finished with it, I had this feeling that kind of like rose up from my stomach up to my heart and I was like, I love my characters. Like, just genuine, wow, I love them. I have fallen in love with my characters. I would die for them. Let's torture them. <laughs> Literally, that was my thought process. It just went, wow, I love my characters. I would die for them. Let's torture them. <laughs> Literally, I'm not making it up. We're in a good place. Because <laughs> that's how I was with Forgotten Bonds, okay? If you've read Forgotten Bonds, you know what I'm talking about. You know. And literally, everybody was like, can you torture so-and-so? I'm like, I'm already doing it. <laughs> what more do you want? So I am, I'm a happy duck for once. Just officially absolute joy. Hopefully I can fall asleep. But this is a magical notebook. This is magical, okay guys? Because I'm actually writing in it. <laughs> Therefore it is magical. <laughs> I don't know why, but it's a thing. It's a magical notebook. Seven bucks on Amazon. Not affiliated. <laughs> Keep my notebook close by so I can imagine new scenes where I can torture my characters. <laughs>